Hello traders and investors. My name is Khalil, and I'm part of the Vector content team. In today's video I will show you some updates for your Binance API key. All Binance users will have their keys updated after 90 days, demanding to attach it again in their platforms, in case they're not in the whitelist. But that's nothing to worry about. First things first, let's access your Binance account. Once logged in, click in the account icon. Next in API management. And then, create API. And realize that now we have two key options to create. The system generated, and the user generated API key. To utilize the user generated API key, you must download a specific software and then create in public API, only then to upload the key to the Binance website. But for this case, let's use the system generated API key. In the next step, you will have to choose an alias for your key. Then run the security check. And again, the final verifications. Done. Now, with the key created, click in Edit, and then select the option Enable Spot and Margin Trading, so you can trade using Vector. Realize that you have data as the API key and API secret. Keep the secret very safely, because it is only displayed at the moment you create your key. You'll need it later to attach your Binance account with Vector. Now, let's get back to the platform, and here the process is really simple. Select the menu trading. And then, add exchange account. Select Binance. Give your account an alias. And right below, add the information of the API we just created. The numeric sequence of your key and the API secret. In the same tab we have the Create API Key button that will lead to the Binance website for you to create it in case you haven't done that yet. Then, just click an Add Account. And done. Now you'll just have to wait a few moments for your account to be ready to trade. In this video, you learned how to update and connect your Binance API key with Vector. Stay tuned for the next updates. See you soon and good trades.